Welcome back everybody. Thank you for watching another episode of Short Guy Drinks Whiskey. Today we're going to be taking a quick taste and discussing three things you didn't know about Knob Creek Whiskey. Interesting fact number one, Knob Creek belongs to the parent company Beam Suntory. Back in 2014, Suntory, a Japanese alcohol company, bought out Jim Beam in a $16 billion merger. So now not only do you get great Japanese whiskey and beer, but now together with Jim Beam, the same company that makes Booker's, Baker's, and Basil Hayden, you also get Knob Creek. Interesting fact number two, apparently Knob Creek is named after a creek that ran through Abraham Lincoln's childhood home. And finally, the person that crafted Knob Creek and pretty much can be credited with the creation of small batch bourbon, Booker Noah, who is the grandson of Jim Beam. Let's get this into a glass. All right, let's give that a quick swirl. We'll check out the color. Ooh, look at that. Nice brown color. A little bit of orange in there. Balancing maybe even on some reds. Oh, man, that looks like it's going to be really chewy, really beefy. Now, on the bottle, you can see it says small batch on there. On the newer ones, you'll see the nine-year age statement. But, man, that looks like this is going to smell fantastic. Let's give it a quick smell. All right, so Knob Creek runs about $35 a bottle, which makes it an excellent mid-range price bourbon. 50% ABV, so maybe a little bit of burn in there. Yeah, just a little bit. If you take too deep up of breath, it gets you right up here. Really sweet smelling. The vanilla. A lot of corn in there. Not a lot of wood though, very little barrel smell in there. Very light spiciness. Not watered down, smells very well textured. No spikiness, very well rounded. Let's give it a taste. And that smells nice. Little bit of a burn, not very much, very little ethanol in there. Nice round. It's got some texture in there, a little bit of punch with a 50%. So it's not watered down. Disperses very evenly. No burn on the finish. You can taste the sweetness, the corn in there. The caramel. Mmm. Medium finish. It lasts pretty long in the mouth. A little dry. Well, $35. This is a great option. So my final thoughts on Knob Creek, $35. You can absolutely not go wrong, especially if you want some tasty cocktails. It's got a nice, well-rounded taste. It's not very spiky. Medium finish is going to stay in your mouth for a long amount of time, and it doesn't burn a lot. So if you're looking for something new to try, check out Knob Creek. Guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.